we're on the beachside town of Burgau, and it's about a 10 minute drive from Lagos. So we rented an ap entire apartment here for a week. We contemplated between staying in Lagos versus staying outside of the city just a little bit. The one nice thing about this place was it was small, it had parking. Once we got here, we could also walk the little tiny town and go to all the little restaurants. But we're sure glad that we did, I think, because it's so busy in Lagos, still beautiful, but it's nice to break away from the touristy area and just get to a little bit quieter area. But the beach behind us is pretty beautiful. Now, Burgau is a very small town, so you got a couple supermarkets, you got a bakery, and lots of restaurants. The restaurants don't usually open up till like 6 p.m. is when everything starts to really happen here. Uh, wonderful beach, little fishing village, uh, and hilly. It's very hilly. So one thing to keep in mind about Burgau, and we are staying here, so we have some time, but we're wandering around, so you do the main street, and it's, it's beautiful, it's picturesque, but then you have a few extra minutes, you go down the back streets, and all the little ones that you wouldn't normally go up. Everywhere we go in this little area is, is beautiful, so it's sometimes really nice just to have some time to explore areas that you wouldn't go and, and stairways that you might not think about going up, but when you do, you find these amazing spots. The gelato flamingo. Down at the Burgau Beach, and it's the end of October, and people are sun tanning and swimming in the ocean. Just a great weather day. I think this happens. October 28th, actually. Yeah, right at the end, and uh, we definitely don't see this in Canada, that's for sure.
I'll just show you a quick tour. We are moving out, so the place is a, a bit of a mess, and uh, we had a great time. It was a nice apartment. Now it, it is off season, so the prices are a lot lower than the high season. That's why we're able to, to come here and, and enjoy this. Here's what $80 off season in the Algarve in Burgau got us. Full size kitchen this time. And that's the benefits of staying somewhere, you know, for a few nights is that we can cook our own meals and everything like that. Um, we had a nice bathroom there. And it was, this was a one bedroom apartment condo style so there's our bedroom we also had a living space so this is really unusual for us uh, to have this much space when we're traveling like this but a nice little sofa and tv and then a nice little deck as well so we're just wrapping up our time here in the algarve and I have to say what an amazing time. We're just sad because we're leaving and wish that we had more time here. We prefer all the small towns that we visited because it's kind of got that old world charm, but the beaches are beautiful. The cliff lines are spectacular. The food and the people are amazing and we would definitely come back. We definitely see the attraction of the Algarve and why so many people are flocking to it, yes. especially during the winter time. It's October, end of October, and I think today we got a sunburn. It is easy to get in between towns via bus or if you have a car it's a lot easier. Uh, we rented a car for the 10 days. We were here for a week and during this time we had a chance to see all the little towns and all the little tourist destinations. So we're, we're really glad that we took the time to go find the smaller communities. The big cities are beautiful as well and they have a lot to offer but on a personal note we, we do like the charm of the small villages cities that we did see so we'll show you in some of the videos that we, we put out for you guys so if you like this video please give us a thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed if you could subscribe that would be lovely it always helps us out people that have been following us thanks again so much we appreciate you and we can't wait to show you more of our adventures all right everybody we'll see you on the next video thanks a lot for watching talk to you later cheers, cheers. that's a wrap